Hi my friends, Miss Jill here again. Have you looked outside today? It's a little rainy, it's a little dark, and it's a little cold. So I think I'm gonna stay nice and cozy today and we are going to read a super fun book together called The Little Island. All right, let's get started. So I have Tuna here. She's nice and snuggled up. She's going to read our story with us. And I also have Mr. Monkey and our little penguin friend again. And they're going to read our story with us as well. And I have some island sounds and an island picture on the TV. There's nice water and trees. All right, let's get started, The Little Island. There was a little island in the ocean. Around it, the winds blew and the birds flew and the tides rose and fell on the shore. How many birds do you see, friends? I see one, two, three, four birds. Clouds passed over it, and the, sw the fish swam around it, and the fog came in from the sea and hid the little island in a soft, wet shadow. How many fish do you see? I see one, two, three fish. The morning was very quiet on the island, with only the spiders sailing their webs against the gentle wind. I see one, two, three spiders. Small flowers, white and blue, and violets with golden eyes, and little waxy white pink chuckleberry blossoms, and one tickly smelling pear tree bloomed on the island, and that was the spring. I see the white and blue flowers and I see the tree. So beautiful. Then one day, all the lobsters crawled in from the sea and hid under the rocks and ledges of the island to shed their shells and let their new ones grow hard and strong in hiding places in the dark. How many lobsters do you see? I see one, two, three, four, five. I see five lobsters hiding. <clears throat> and the seals came barking down from the north to lie on the sunny rocks and raise their baby seals. Oh, do you see the little baby seal? You can tell that he's the baby because he's white. All the other seals are brown. They have their adult fur. And the kingfishers came from the south to build nests. I see two birds. They're blue and white. And this one looks like it has a little bit of an orange brown on his back. And the gulls laid their eggs on the rocky ledges. I see one, two, three, four birds. And wild strawberries turned red. Summer had come to the little island. <clears throat> so the seasons changed. It was spring and now it's summer and the strawberries are all turning ripe. Boats sailed to the little island from far away and herring and mackerel leaped out of the water, all silver in the moonlight. The seaweed squeaked at low tide and little green pears grew on the pear tree. A black crow flew over. I see one, two, three fish jumping out of the water. And a little kitten came to the island with some people on a picnic. The kitten prowled around the island and saw it was all surrounded by water. What a little land, said the kitten. This little island is as little as big is big. Look, I see two people and I see one kitten coming to the island for a picnic. So are you, said the island. Maybe I am a little island too, said the kitten. 
a little fur island in the air. And then he left the ground and jumped into the air. That is just what you are, said the little island. I see two birds and I see one big kitten. But I am part of this big world, said the little kitten. My feet are on it. So am I, said the little island. No, you are not, said the kitten. Water is all around you and cuts you off from the land. Ask any fish, said the island. Look at the little kitten. He's exploring this big island. So the kitten caught a fish. Answer me this or I'll eat you up, said the kitten. How is an island a part of the land? Come with me, said the fish, down into the dark secret places of the sea and I will show you. I can't swim, said the cat. Show me another way or I'll eat you up. Then you must take it on faith what I tell you, said the fish. What's that, said the cat. Faith, to believe what I tell you about what you don't know, said the fish. The cat doesn't believe the fish. And the fish told the kitten how all the land is one land under the sea. The cat's eyes were shining with the secret of it. And because he loved secrets, he believed it and let the fish go. Look at all the fish and the lobsters and the crabs and the shells and the starfish. They're all living together under the sea. And he got on his boat and sailed away into the setting sun. The little island had a little woods on it with seven big trees in it and 17 small bushes and one big rock. Birds came to the woods on the island and butterflies and moths flew over the ocean till they got there. That's so beautiful. I can see the ocean and the sun and a sailboat. Night came to the little island, dark and still and seven little fireflies flashed in the darkness. A bat flew around and around the pear tree and woke up the owl. The wind whistled. I see the bat and I see the owl and I also see the pear tree. You can see all the pears growing off of it. Then came the storm. The wind blew from the southeast. Waves as big as glassy mountains came before it and lightning and thunder, and always the howling, moaning, and whistling of the wind. And then the storm passed and left the little island where it found it in the summer sea. Wow, those are some big, scary waves, huh? You can barely see the, o the island. You can only see the tops of the trees. Autumn came, and the yellow pears dropped slowly to the ground, and winter came and the snow fell softly like a great quiet secret in the night cold and still. Oh, it's all white because it's all snow. It's the winter time now. Nights and days came and passed and summer and winter and the sun and wind and the rain. And it was good to be a little island, part of the world in a world of its own, all surrounded by the bright blue sea. That's so beautiful. I see blue, I see brown and yellow and green. How beautiful. And all the animals live together. Did you like that story, Tuna? Thank you guys so much for reading a story with me. I had so much fun learning about this island and all the animals that live in the ocean. Um, I think I'm going to do a craft in a little bit. So I will see you guys later. I miss you all so much and I hope you're staying safe and happy and healthy. And I will see you guys so soon. Bye.